This demo will walk you through a sample ranch house using the entire building design software package. To start the project, go to Modeling Tools. Then select the Building Design Data menu. Create a project folder under C colon backslash truss and click Open. The four basic input screens will appear. Enter the general information for your project. When the trust draws, verify that it is correct and click Exit. The Model Options screen will appear. Input your rules for design. Now enter the wall default design data for the project. This example has only one level. Select the roof truss uppermost floor wall layout. Enter your project information for the main building. For this example, we have a front add-on. Select Truss Layout and click the check mark button. Click the Yes button to create the trusses. The trusses will draw. Modifications to the trusses can be made with the buttons above. Click the 3D button to see the 3D view of the truss system. This is the 3D view. The walls can be created when the trusses are complete. Click the green arrow button to return to the main input screen. Select the Wall Plan Layout button and click the check mark button. The walls will draw. Click on Modify Wall to add openings. Click on the wall you want to modify. In the Wall Panel Layout screen, click on the Wall Openings button to add a window or a door. Select No to create a new opening. Follow the instructions to create the opening. Select the opening type, door or window. Choose the opening size from the window schedule created for this project. Input the necessary information for your opening and click the check mark button. The opening will draw on the wall. Notice. The material list will adjust for the needed materials. When all the openings have been placed in the walls, the interior walls can be created. Click on the interior walls icon. Select Yes to create new interior walls. Drag the mouse at the location of the wall. Modify the inputs as necessary. Right-click the mouse button to complete the wall group. The interior wall will draw. Continue the same process for all interior walls. Let's take a look at the walls in 3D. Click this icon to view the entire building in 3D. Click the back arrow button to view the truss layout again. 
select Truss Layout, Now that the project is drawn for the trusses and the walls, it is time to analyze the trusses. Right-click your mouse button and select Auto Analyze Building Trusses. The trusses will analyze and the layout will draw when all the trusses are finished. A solid line indicates the truss passed. If there is a dotted line for the truss, then changes need to be made for the truss to pass. To redesign the trusses that failed, you can click on the View Truss icon. Click on the truss that failed. The truss plot will draw. Click on the green Analyze button to view the failures in the truss. The red indicates where the failure occurs. Use the options above to make changes to the truss. Select a stronger material type for the members that failed. Click the check mark button to analyze the changes you made. Make changes until the truss passes. When the truss passes, a solid line will show. Continue this process for all trusses that did not pass. You can also use the Individual Truss Design option to analyze the trusses that failed. Select the File menu. Select Open Existing Truss File. Select the truss in the project folder and click the Open button. Make the changes needed in the individual truss input screens. The truss plot will draw. Click on the Analyze button. The report will print. Scroll down to see if the truss passed with the changes you made. The truss passed, so the Bill of Materials icon will appear. Click on the BOM icon to save your information. Click the check mark button. Now the information is saved. Select the Modeling Tools menu to view the truss layout again. Select Building Layout Drawing. Select your project and click the Open button. Select Roof Truss Layout. Click on Truss Layout and the check mark button. It is very important to note that because you have already analyzed the trusses, you want to select No to overwrite the trusses. The layout now shows that all the trusses have passed by solid line. Click the arrow back button to view the wall layout. Select the wall plan layout and click the check mark button. To analyze the walls, click on the Analyze Walls button. Select how you want to analyze the shear bays. 
the walls will analyze and a report will print. All the walls passed. Now we can print the reports for the project. Select the Trust Project Reports. The Project Summary Reports will give all the materials needed to fabricate the project. The wall files can be included. Select the project and click the check mark button. The report will print. Other reports can be viewed and printed with more information. All truss and wall analysis files can be printed for approval and fabrication. Select Truss Project Reports. Select Truss Design and Estimating Reports. Select the reports you wish to print. Wall reports can be printed also. Select Wall Panel Pro. and print wall panel reports. Select the wall reports you desire to print. Thank you for viewing our demo. We hope it will give you a better understanding of our software. Check back for more tutorials.